For a while now, Apple has been rumored to discontinue the iPhone Plus model starting next year and replace it with the tentatively named iPhone 17 Slim. As the name implies, this will be record-breakingly thin, just like Apple's latest iPad Pro. Today, some more details about the iPhone 17 Slim have been leaked by Ming Shiku, a longtime industry analyst and a reliable source for Apple-related rumors. He claims the iPhone Plus currently makes up only about 5% to 10% of iPhone shipments, which is why it's getting the axe. Now, let's dive into the juicy details. The iPhone 17 Slim will feature a 6.6-inch screen with a 1260x2740 resolution and the new A19 chip at the helm. Notably, the iPhone 17 Pro models will use the A19 Pro. Its dynamic island area will be similar to that of the current iPhones, and its metal frame will use a titanium alloy with a lower percentage of titanium compared to the iPhone 17 Pro and Pro Max. Hold on, did you catch that? A titanium alloy with less titanium. What do you think about that? Let me know in the comments below. Interestingly, iPhone 17 Slim is also said to support Apple's long-delayed in-house 5G chip and only one rear camera. That's right, just one single rear camera. Isn't that a big step backward in terms of current mobile trends where multiple lenses are the norm? But wait! Ku emphasizes that Apple will emphasize innovative form factor design with the iPhone 17 Slim rather than competing on hardware specifications. In other words, looks will be everything with this one. Style over substance. Do you think one camera is enough in today's multi-lens world? Comment your thoughts. But before we dive deeper, I want to ask you, what do you think about Apple focusing on design over hardware specs? Do you prefer a sleek, stylish phone over one with multiple cameras and higher specs? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. This shift in focus is certainly an interesting gamble on Apple's part, and one that may just pay off. After all, for it to be successful, it only needs to capture about 15% of all new iPhone sales, which would make it two or three times more successful than the model it's replacing. But let's be real, could this bold move by Apple mean the end of an era for the beloved iPhone Plus? Only time will tell. Hey there! If you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon so you never miss an update on the latest tech trends and updates. Quick question. Do you remember the first time you held an iPhone Plus? Imagine holding the iPhone 17 slim, thinner, lighter, but just one camera. What would you choose? More features or a sleek design? Thank you for watching.